In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a panning effect on a still picture in CapCut. Let's get started. First, open CapCut and create a new project. Import the picture you want to add the panning effect to by clicking on the Import button and selecting your image. Once your picture is imported, add it to the track. Let's preview our video before editing it. Now, let's add motion to it using keyframes. First, move the playhead to the start of your picture in the timeline. Tap on the keyframe icon at the toolbar, which looks like a diamond symbol. This will set the starting point of the panning effect. With the first keyframe set, increase the scale of the image. For example, if you want to start the pan from the left, drag the picture to the right side of the previous screen until you reach the border of the image. Now, move the playhead to the end of the timeline and add another keyframe by tapping the keyframe icon again. Next, adjust the position of the image for this keyframe. Drag the image to the left side of the previous screen again until you reach the border. You should now have two keyframes, one where the pan starts and one where it ends. Once you're done, play back your video to see the smooth panning effect across your still picture. Once you're satisfied with the panning effect, click the export button to save your video. And that's it! You've successfully created a panning effect on a still picture in CapCut. Thanks for watching and happy editing! If you find this video helpful so far, please consider subscribing to help YouTube algorithm show my videos to other nerds like us. Thanks!